Hello everybody, this is Kyoshi here. Welcome back to another video. In this video, I'll be reviewing the McDonald's Happy Meal Toys, the Disney Encanto movie toys. I have four toys so far out of the eight um, from this set. And so without further ado, let's get started. We're starting with the uh, Happy Meal box. Um, I think it's a very beautiful box. I usually don't keep my Happy Meal boxes. Actually, I don't really eat Happy Meal that often unless it's a a certain wave or a certain series that I really like, like the characters or the movies. Uh, I'm getting this one because um, um, I do think this is a good movie. I have not watched it. I've seen the trailers. I have not seen the actual movies yet, uh, the movie yet, but um, I, I do think this is a pretty good movie. And also I heard that um, starting next year, January, Madonna will stop all of their uh, plastic toys. Um, they will go all uh, paper, paper toys or paper carts or card games, stuff like that. So um, this might, I don't know, I don't know, don't quote me on this, but this might just be the very last plastic toys Madonna is going to be releasing for a long, long time. Maybe there's going to be another one coming uh, in December. Um, but what I heard is starting next year, um, they will stop all of the plastic toys. So yeah, that's uh, that's unfortunate. But uh, if they're doing it for the planet, if it does help out on the planet, I guess I have, to, I have to accept that, you know, I do want the planet to be cleaner and better and, you know, less plastic, you know. But yeah, here's the packaging. I really like the box, actually, the Happy Meal box. It's very beautiful. We see a huge mansion. I think this is where um, the characters live. I don't know. I've not seen the movie, but it, but it's very beautiful. Um, that's why I'm keeping this Happy Meal box, because I think this is very beautiful. Over here, we have the main character, um, Marabel, Mirabel. And then here we have the eight figures or eight toys from this set. Um, I got this one, this one, this one, and this one. We'll go over it in a bit. Nothing much going on here. Nothing much going on here. Cool. Let's move this to the side and let's focus on the on the toys um we have four toys to do let's do luisa first this is luisa this is number three um okay it comes with the luisa figure herself plus um four of these um so I mean cool and four of I think horses. I'm not sure what she's holding, but she, I don't know. I've not seen the movie again, but I think she might be, she, maybe she has a strain, like superpower <laughs> uh, of the strain. Like she can lift something very heavy. Uh, based on instruction, uh, what you do is you just try to add this to her hands. And then let's see how many you can do. I've tried to do it off the camera previously. It's very difficult. I can only get two in. I couldn't even do more than two. Uh, maybe I can do the third one, maybe. I don't know. Um, let me know if there's a trick to do this, but uh, so far, oh, okay, I got three. Let's try this one. Ooh, I got all four. I mean, honestly, off camera, I never succeeded, but voila, I did it. Uh, so this is how you play this uh, Louisa figure. Cool. Um, What's next? Next, next, next. Let's do this one. I think this is cool. This is Camilo, and it's number six. Uh, very nice here. I do like this one a lot. Um, it looks like, you know, there's different characters on the wheel. And it's like those uh, TikToks or those, you know, you just cross things out when you, when you, when you have, when you form a line, you cross it out. I guess that's that's when you win. They also give you these coins, um, so you know where you at. Um, I'm not gonna play it, but uh, you got an idea, you know. Let's say you wrote this, and then the arrow shows this lady right here. Then you put this chip, one of this chip on one of these boards, I guess. I guess you're only supposed to use one board to play this game. I, I really don't know, but I think you choose one board, any any of the sides. Let's say do this one, and then I got this one, so I put the chip on top of here. So once I have all three of these, then I, I win the game, I guess. Whoever um, whoever get the line, form the line first, whoever win, I'm assuming. Um, cool. I think I, I, I do like this one. Um, I think this might be the favorite one out of the four that I have. 
Cool. This is Kamido. And next, let's do this guy. This, this is Chips, Chips P? Chips P. And this is number seven. Chips P number seven. Um, okay. Cool. Oh, she <laughs> he looks grumpy. But cool, cool, okay. Uh, it also comes with four parrots. I think these are parrots or birds or crawls, who knows, um, in three different colors. Basically, what you do, I think McDonald's have a lot of these 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 toys in the past. Basically, basically you just put them here, and then you, uh, they have like a little rolling ball here, and then you just try to press it in and just, you know. Um, this is a bad, exa bad example, but I'll try it again. You just roll it, yeah, like this. You got the idea? Um, they have, I think they've released a lot of these similar um, similar toys in the past, but uh, cool. This is the character. Nice. And last, we have Isabella. This is number eight. Okay, Isabella. It comes in two pieces, actually three pieces. Here's the uh, shoot out arrow plate. And then here's Isabella. You there's a peg on the back on, on on her feet and it just uh, put it together like so. Cool. Okay, and we also comes with three cardboard or paper um these shooting shooters, shooting shooting bars. Um cool. Um how you do it, it's very similar to um uh ch chispy here but what you do is you shoot this thing out by pressing it you just press it it will come out like so and then you try to attack um attack these oh let me see how i can do it better okay let's put these here we have all these right here and then let's tr let's try it basically Okay, let's move this away. Uh, let's you just press this and try to shoot it like so. Uh, we'll do one more time. Um, cool. Oh, cool. You got the idea. Yeah. So these are all the four that I got. Uh, I think I will stop the collecting right here. Uh, you know, right here. I'm not gonna. I'm not. I'm not trying to get the whole wave. I think I just tried to have some of the encounter figures in my collection. Like I said, this might just be the very last plastic uh, figures toys we will ever get from Happy Meal going forward. Maybe there's gonna be another wave. Don't quote me on it. I, I, I'm not an expert in a Happy Meal. I don't know anybody working in McDonald's that can tell me those information. But uh, yeah, as far as I, I, I know, this might just be the very last um, or one, the wave before the very last one um the plastic toy that my daughters will ever produce so i think it's it, it's gonna mean something to collect these um as as a farewell to my childhood you know when i was a kid um when my grandparents and my parents take me to mcdonald's i always get happy meal and you know happy meal toys are part of a part of my childhood actually but yeah so here is um uh, my quick review on the disney encounter mcdonald's happy meal toys thank you guys so much for watching and oh by the way there are they're available at McDonald's. So um, if you guys like the movie or you guys just want to keep part of your childhood before it's gone, um, go, go pick up some of these toys. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.